Hey guys, welcome to episode number 453. Today is Tuesday, so I have another tank tip for you. And as you saw, that's how easy it is to install a self-tapping air valve into a piece of PVC pipe. Now, I have two different air valves here. The ones that I've used in the past are these ones right here. They're normal air valves. And this one over here is a self-tapping air valve. I got both of these from Gemco. They don't actually sell these ones anymore. All they sell are the self-tapping ones. And I can totally see why. Essentially, what you had to do before was you had to pre-drill a hole in your PVC pipe. And then you needed to use a tap at very low speed in a drill to get your threads in that PVC pipe and only then could you take your normal air valve and thread that into the PVC pipe. It's sort of treated more like a machine screw in that the threads are you know very thin and um, they line up perfectly with the threads that you're tapping. Right? That's sort of a, a labor intensive process. You gotta switch out the bit um, on your drill a few times before you can even get one of these things installed. And when you're doing a fish room, when you're doing an air system, when you're doing a water system, it's really all about speed and efficiency. And so with your self-tapping air valves, you can see, if we compare the two, you can see that the threads are quite a bit bigger and they have a little bit more bite to them. So as long as you're using the right drill bit, in this case it's a number 14 drill bit, you can pre-drill your hole and then immediately all you need to do is put one of these self-tapping air valves in the chuck of your drill, apply um, pressure straight down and then drill at a very low speed, very straight into that hole until you have it basically almost bottomed out. And uh, after that you can just sort of adjust these, uh, hand adjust these with uh, a, a wrench or pliers or whatever else you have on hand. You can do them with your hands too to get them all to line up in a row for your air system or your water system. Anyways guys, I got a whole bag of these from Gemco so that tomorrow I can complete my fry rack with these to get water reliably to where it needs to go. So anyways, I thought that was a quick explanation and uh, a quick comparison between these two air valves. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys later.